In this lesson, we're going to be creating a new flow from scratch. So we're going to do so in three steps. The first step will be creating the flow from the dashboard. Next, we'll be syncing the menu block. Third, we will be copying and pasting that menu block into the new page template and also into the map. So let's create a new flow from the main dashboard, which is as simple as heading to the main page, creating a new item and choosing from either a fresh new flow or one of our existing pre-built templates. For this video, we're going to create a new flow from scratch, which is as simple as hitting that plus icon in the new template. And while this is loading, we can give our project or our new flow a name. For this one, let's call it our new client portal. And what we're going to be building from scratch is a fresh client portal. Typically, this loading process can take between 90 seconds and two minutes. Just give it a moment and come back once you can see that the full Flotion flow has been loaded. Okay, once our new flow has loaded, we can enter in by selecting the page and we will be first of all renaming our flow to what our what we've done earlier. It's going to be a new client portal. We would probably give it a name of our client. And the first thing you'll see is a quick GIF uh, and a small video demo of how we can set up our synced menu and new pages. We're going to do that now together in this video. So the first step will be to select the callout block, which is which includes all of the objects inside of the Flotion editor and the Flotion menu. Next, we're going to turn this into a synced block. So I'll do that now. And then we can select this copy and sync option. So this is now pasted and copied in my clipboard. I will then navigate to the new, new page template. I'll hit configure template. And this is going to let me enter into the template for our new page. This is what you should see by default. And what we need to do is follow this instruction and paste that synced block menu, which we've just created and copied here. And we can right click or you can hit control V to paste that full menu. So now we have a synced menu inside of our new page template. I can remove this instruction and I can actually just navigate back to the home of our new client portal by hitting this home button. Now that we have our new page synced up with the menu, we can copy it one more time. It's actually still in my clipboard. So I can just head over to the map page. And this is the last step for setup. Once again, I'm going to add a new block beneath and I'm going to paste that menu. So now when I head home, I can create new pages, which will have the synced block menu in them. I can head home and on my map, I also have my menu ready to go. This also means that every time we create a new page, we'll have our full list of layouts, components, forecasting, assets, and embed options. So that's how you create and sync a new flow inside of Notion, and you are ready to start building.